In the next few minutes, we are going to see the dangers of an uncontrolled hydrocarbon release in the vicinity of diesel-driven air compressors and steam generators used during well surface activities. What's at risk here is people's lives. Selecting temporary equipment comes with responsibilities. First and foremost is safety, yours, mine, and the people around us. As a result of incidents in recent times, the industry recognized that whilst hydrocarbons are at surface, no open decks can be guaranteed as permanently free from flammable gas mixtures. Temporary equipment can introduce new hazards to existing installations, even after following the rig's defined area classification rules. Those rules define safe areas and adjacent hazardous areas, often not separated by physical barriers, where incorrect equipment can adversely affect safety case evaluations. The minimum safe distance in accordance with API RP500 and IP15 is 3 meters from equipment handling or storing flammable fluid. Tolerating the use of rig safe equipment in these neighboring apparently safe areas appears difficult to justify. Can you be certain that this mitigates risks for your operations? Rig safe areas often identified as permanently safe tolerate the use of low protection equipment. Zone 2 areas may contain hydrocarbon and require high protection equipment for operation within hazardous environments. Catastrophic failures such as line rupture are not considered by an area classification study. A hazard identification process such as HAZOP should consider these events. Zone 2 rated equipment are inherently safer and engineered to prevent flammable mixtures reaching ignition sources. Equipment designed for the latest drill class specification employs automatic closure. Drill class compressors are equipped with ATEX fire and gas systems, capable of integrating fully with the rig's safety philosophy. Both compressor types are rated to deliver 1,600 CFM at 150 PSI and require permanently open ventilation during use. Operating at full load, Zone 2 compressors will have a maximum surface and exhaust temperature of 200 degrees centigrade, compared with more than 600 degrees for a rig safe unit. Following shutdown, rig safe surface temperatures remain above the auto ignition point of hydrocarbons for many minutes. Zone 2 equipment employs proprietary fail safe components that isolate potential flame paths to engine and atmosphere. Rig safe equipment has none, increasing the chance of ignition. In our scenario, a rig safe compressor located 3 meters from a temporary line containing hydrocarbons is compliant with current regulations. Air is constantly circulated through the enclosures to cool hot surfaces. On detection of gas, the Zone 2 compressor employs systems to prevent ignition and shuts down automatically, forming a gas-tight seal, thus allowing safe manual ESD activation, common in well-testing situations. In the scenario described, the rig safe compressor with multiple sources of ignition will continue to operate, but with potentially catastrophic consequences. Following that step change in safety philosophy, Scantec has invested significantly, supporting the drive for safer equipment and now operates the world's largest modern fleet of Zone 2 air compressors and Zone 2 steam generators. For further information or assistance with equipment selection, please contact us.